Sack time. I think he's tasting fine. Looking for a Twinkie in the zombie land of mine. Well, it's snack time. Munchie. There's Doritos on the line. Holly Sorbet ate it. And a touch of turpentine. Hey there, Teddy Rubskin here. And uh, it's time for snack time where we talk about snacks. And today we gotta fucking talk about the Impossible Whopper, right? Which is uh, Burger King's newest addition to the fucking menu. Which is, uh, the, what they're advertising it is that, is that it's a burger that, well, it's not actually meat, right? That's the idea, right? Is that it's, it's a vegetarian fucking burger that tastes just like a real fucking burger, right? Well, it tastes like a Whopper implying that the Whopper actually tastes like real meat, which is debatable, right? Very debatable whether the Whopper, you know, it, 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 wait, 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 wait. The, the, the impossible Whopper is supposed to taste so much like real meat that you can't fucking tell, right? So, I would think the only way to do that is to have a side-by-side, -side, like, taste test, right? Like, give me a Whopper and the impossible Whopper, right, right next to each other, and, and don't tell me which one is which. Let me try them. And that's what I did, right? I tried the Impossible Whopper right next to uh, the original Whopper, right? But, uh, honestly, between the two, I could tell that the Impossible Whopper was not real meat. I could totally tell, you know. To try to try the re original Whopper, tastes like, yeah, whatever. But, but the Impossible Whopper just didn't quite taste like meat. Let's be honest, right? You can fucking tell. They, I mean, the whole whole challenge of the Impossible Whopper is just kind of this social media fucking thing, right? They, in fact, they launched this whole thing on April 1st. April 1st, so some people thought it was a joke, right? And so people were talking about it online. Like, wait, 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 Burger King claims they have a burger that's vegetarian that you can't tell that it's fucking beef. I mean, other people are, like, even questioning the advertisement. It says it's not 100% beef. Little do they know, their Whopper patty was actually made from plants. You're f***ing kidding me. We're not, Grant. <laughs> Wait, plant what, what are you talking about? No animals, just plants. Really? <laughs> this is a f***ing cow. <laughs> no f***ing cow. Tastes like a Whopper. Tastes like a Whopper. Tastes like a beef burger. It's made of f***ing beef right here. You see that? It's beef. Wait, but, but whatever it is, it doesn't fucking quite have the right texture. It doesn't taste like real meat. And that's the big fucking thing. But, you know... It does taste quite a bit like the crappy Whopper, which is by far not my fucking favorite fast food burger. Fuck. Well, we've got our hands on some, <laughs> and it's just about time to go ahead and give it that taste test. So It's delicious. Hey, you want a piece? It's really I'm good. Gonna it I'm going sideways on the thumb on that one. It, it's all right, <laughs> mm. and if you don't tell me what it is, I'd probably eat it and be okay with it, but yeah. you told me so, you know. You know how I am. <laughs> the guy loves his meat. You know He's not cheap either. The Whopper's pretty expensive. You know, and the Impossible Whopper is even more expensive. It's a whole dollar more than the fucking cost of a regular Whopper. So I just spent this fucking money for no fucking reason? Well, wait, no, no, it's for science. It's for fucking science, right? Yeah. And science, which is my fucking mouth, has determined that the, the Impossible Whopper challenge is not that impossible, you know. The one means it is impossible to taste just like the... But, 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 wait, 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 wait. Challenge defeated. I can tell I can tell that it wasn't a fucking real <coughs> fucking Whopper, but wait. Maybe, maybe, maybe other people can't. I don't know. Maybe I have a superior pelly. <laughs> but, 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 I don't know. I don't know. You, you should try it yourself if, if, if you think, if you want to, you know. They're it, it, selling the Impossible Whopper at, at fucking Burger King right now. And you can try it, you know, if you want to. Uh, but, I mean, the whole notion of fucking uh, a vegetarian burger being a fucking... A healthier option than, than a beef burger, that the idea that the Impossible Whopper is healthier for you than, than, than the, the burger made out of beef? I don't think that's necessarily the case. I mean, how many fucking chemicals are in this fucking thing to make it fucking look and taste like beef? You know, I mean, what kind of shit's in there? Like textured vegetable protein and who knows what kind of fucking garbage? I mean, seriously. The Impossible Whopper replaces the traditional beef with a plant-based patty. Unlike traditional veggie burgers, the Impossible Whopper is intended to mimic the look, texture, and taste of a traditional Whopper. I think it's fucking impossible to believe that the Impossible Whopper could possibly be healthier than just the regular beef Whopper. But then again, 
who knows how much fecal matter is in the fucking regular whopper, right? Because, you know, with the way they process the beef, it's kind of like a hard thing to avoid. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. But, uh, yeah, well, anyway, that, that, that's the impossible whopper. And what the way to do to do to do? <laughs> Until fucking next time, keep on fucking snacking. Fritos, reheatable taquitos, slum jam, cheese fries, patio burritos, cinnamon and pique, lesser mayonnaise, fish nipple, frame burger, food jazz, fish sticks. We conducted an experiment to evaluate how well Whopper fans know their beloved Whopper. The people you will see here are real people, and these are their real reactions. I've probably eaten about two Whoppers a week for the last 20 years. I love Whoppers. I've turned Burger King into a crime scene in a time or two. I absolutely love beef. Beef all the way. Little do they know, their Whopper patty was actually made from plants. <laughs> That's impossible. It tasted just like a Whopper should taste. Lies. A patty with zero milligrams of cholesterol, 17 grams of protein, 100% Whopper, and 0% beef. We know it's impossible to believe. The Impossible Whopper, only at Burger King in St. Louis. I'm confused. I'm, I'm reevaluating my life. Let's take a look at what's trending. This one had us asking whether it was just an April Fool's joke or not. Well, it's true, folks. Burger King is testing a new Impossible Burger right here in St. Louis. The only place you can get it. It's a flame-grilled, plant-based patty. Plant-based patty. Plant-based patty. Plant-based Plant -based hot dogs. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, we won't That's do that to you. No, no. Impossible. We know. I am going to eat this, though. <laughs> we know. You can't touch this. You can't touch this.